Hey guys and welcome to Lounge TV. I'm Larry and that there is my hand holding the camera because Tom's not all the way up yet. So I decided I'm not waiting for him. I'm going to vlog anyway. What's today's vlog going to be? <coughs> Excuse me. I'm feeling a little bit better. <coughs> I still cough every once in a while. Get a little phlegm up. Excuse me while I spit it out. But um, every once in a while I, I cough. My leg is better. Let me see if I show you um, it's a little yellowish right there that's about it got a little cuts on there but other than that it's okay my shoulder now it, it hurts like heck when I do this so I just try not to do that but uh, I'm gonna stay away from doing any motions where I'm working with my arm in the back like that but it feels better I don't think I tore anything luckily even though it sounded really weird when it happened let's see what else uh, my back is feeling better so far but i haven't got to do anything because it's been cloudy for almost a week now uh, raining on and off like uh, everything oh yeah my my thoughts and prayers go out to uh people in north carolina and and uh other places that have this helene went through this is why we're getting cloudy every day is because of uh this thing but we you know we hardly got anything other than misty rain mostly but uh man it's the stuff that's happened down south and stuff it's uh terrible i mean whole towns have been washed away stuff it's sad there's people missing so uh yeah but anyway so uh one of the things i'm gonna, I'm gonna set this down on the uh yeah this is perfect over here i know it just got a little bit dark guys but i'm gonna put it set it down on the well I'll try to get this thing set at the right yeah uh, a little crooked okay yeah so anyway I wanted to do this vlog because it's uh wanted to do it on uh, quitting YouTube yeah now I don't know about you guys but uh, I get to this place a lot of times where it's I don't know if it's like it's creative block um, just all in all tired uh, you don't see the fruits of you know of your, all your labor you know with YouTube uh, um, the price goes not the price but your your CPM goes down drastically especially in the in certain months but this this year was way worse than any year that I've ever seen this hat looks ridiculous by the way um, yeah so sometimes I get to the point where sometimes I just want to quit I mean because there there's times when like we have to make a certain amount of money we have to um, I mean, we, we survive if we don't, but we, we try, our goal is to, to make a certain amount of money on YouTube. And for the most part, we do. But then there's months, like in this, you know, that just happened that, that we don't. And it gets very discouraging. And I'm sure that there's other people out there that can understand what I'm talking about. Whether um, your views are down or not, or you're not getting views, your subs are going away or not getting subs. Uh, and or if you and if you did get monetized that you're losing money or you know you're, you watch your money go down and everything it's very easy to get into this thing where woe is me uh, this sucks blah 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 truth is truth be told that me Joe and, and Tom have to get paid and if we don't get paid we can't afford we can still afford to do videos but we can't like like I'm actually contemplating whether I have to go get a job now because um, I have to I have bills to pay in my house and stuff and and, uh, and everything and and I still want to do it and I'm not going to quit don't get me wrong when I talk about quitting I'm talking about this is just a feeling that you get sometimes you might get creative block or whatever which I have right now and I think you know part of that is because of my sister's passing that I've not been in a really good place and stuff um, it's just very hard and I I want to just say to you guys that I, a lot of people feel the same way that I do they go through this spell of you know and, and maybe you quit and, and everything you know YouTube um, it's it's hard to keep pushing forward and pushing forward you give so much um, it's very hard for me to come up with ideas sometimes for videos like today I'm just talking to you guys but I'm being real I'm keeping it real with you guys on this video that um if I get attacked by a bee, my, um, that's what'll hurt too my shoulder. But um, 
yeah, I mean, like, I'm the one that comes up with ideas. Joe used to come up with a lot of ideas. He hasn't come up, you know, with, uh, for, you know, challenges and stuff like that. He just, he just doesn't do it. And that's because he's got a lot of stuff going on in his life with different things. So, you know, I get that and everything. It's just, it makes it harder for me. So I'm not sure where we're going to be going on this channel. Um, you know, maybe I need to cut back on it. Uh, maybe I'm doing too much. You know, these are all thoughts that go through your head, right? And everything. I'm going to keep on keeping on as long as I can. But I just I want you guys to understand it's like it's, it's hard sometimes um, to come up with stuff or ideas and everything. You know, it's just like with the... Uh, the reaction videos and then the other thing is, is like when anybody that's doing YouTube and there's a lot of you guys that are watching that, that, that do YouTube and you get discouraged right away sometimes you just got to fight through it I mean I've been in this place before I've I've and I fought through it and everything you know and then you do reaction videos like what we were doing on Ursula because you know you get all these people that'll say to you oh do reaction video do reaction videos blah blah, blah like you used to and uh so you try it out, you know, you're like, oh yeah, I'll do that. It, it makes it easier. I don't have to really think that much of anything. Um, although this, these reaction videos are harder because there's so many cuss words in there that Tom has to, it takes Tom hours to edit all them out for this because we don't want to get demonetized. That would be one of the worst mistakes. So you have that going on and then you see your views like on your first reaction video. Ooh, all right, they're doing good. And then all of a sudden you see them, psh, drop way off which I never understood because it's like why would so many people watch that first video of a series and then not the second or the third or the fourth when it's still the series and but see a lot of times we get caught up in like oh like maybe in our podcast or something people want to see this that or the other thing and you know give us an idea for the reaction video so we do that but they're not thousands of people they're just they're just the people that, that like reaction videos that are actually saying that other people might not like that so you get as a youtuber you get caught in between that like what should you do should you should you do what what people are asking you to do or should you do um other stuff that you know you know or or think that might might get better views i don't know this is where it gets so into your head and you don't know what in the world to do anymore i mean that's that's what it comes down to is like you just get into this place where you're stuck. I don't know what to do. I, I, I really don't know what to do anymore sometimes. Um, and then the daylight hours are shorter now, so we can't do a whole lot of challenges outside because, you know, um, people have to work. Joe has to work. You know, Kevin has to work. So by the time they come over, it's dark. We can't really do much outside. And then if it rains on, on the day that we're filming, we're really stuck, right? So, um like I said, it's it's hard, and we will fight through it like we do every single time, and hopefully, you know, we'll get back to that place where like, okay, I feel comfortable now and everything. This is the time of the year that money goes up, so that's a positive thing for you guys that are that are monetized. Um, but I also want to say is like, you only fail when you quit. It's the only time you fail. So we'll just go through this. If I do have to wind up getting a real job, right? Even though YouTube is a real job, guys. If you're getting paid, it's a real job. You're working. You're not, it's not just easy, right? And your mind, you know, you're thinking constantly, what am I going to do this video, blah, 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 blah. Um, if I have to get a regular job, whether it be pumping gas even, I'll just have to do it. Um, and I will still make videos, maybe just not be putting that video out every day between the two channels or whatever. Um, not stopping the channel I'm, don't get me wrong i know a lot of people are going to say clickbait it's not really clickbait because this video is about quitting youtube and there and there a lot of people go through the exact same thing that i go through with this i don't care where you are if you're the biggest creator or the smallest creator everybody's thinking the same thing i'm just trying to encourage that you just fight through these things and i've done it before and i'll do it again hopefully and if the worst comes to worse Still not going to get rid of the channels, but these thoughts creep into your head. You know, there's a lot of people that actually just stop. I would encourage you not to. I would encourage you to fight through the slow times, even if you have to just get in there and talk on camera and convince yourself that this is a good thing. You'll, you'll find sometimes that they might be the best videos. They might even do the best. Who knows, right? 
um, and, and unless you try and keep trying and trying and trying, you never know when that one video is going to click off. We have yet been doing this for 10 years, and we've have never had a video that has at, at the beginning of you know, when, but that was all because of Jesse being um, attached to his channel. That that's why the views would, you know, we'd get a lot of views, but we weren't. You know, that was back when you'd make, you know, 30 cents, 19 cents, a thousand views. Um, it's better now, the pay-wise, but the views are way down, but it's still better pay-wise. Um, yeah, but that, so, but we've never had a video that, that we, we put out, and it's like, we've never had a viral video, ever. <laughs> never. I mean, that would have been cool if we would have had just one in 10 years. Well, it's not 10 years yet. It's going to be 10 years this year which is amazing that we've stuck it out for this long and we've been doing it. And we're going to continue to do it, guys. We're not stopping. I'm not saying that. I'm saying that these thoughts come into my mind, and I'm sure they have in yours. And some people, it, it's even defeated them to the point where, because they don't see their subscribers coming in to the point of even getting monetized. Imagine not doing videos when you're not even getting monetized. Uh, the incentive for doing it has to be just pure love for, for making content. And I love making content. Um, you know, unfortunately for the things that I love to make content on, they don't give views at all. So it's like, you know, our that's news to us, um, doesn't give views at all for the amount of work that we do. It's not, it's not worth, uh, doing it. I mean, I miss them. I miss them tremendously, but they also take a tremendous amount of time to do those videos. So unfortunately we don't really do, we haven't done one of them in a while, you know, with the skits and stuff. That's the other thing. Skits. I love doing skits, man. That's, that's probably the biggest thing that I miss is skits. You know, um, whether it's the drunk guys or slappy guys or uh, angry guys. You know, the cussing came in. You can't do the cussing on YouTube and everything. So, and I, and I don't fault YouTube for that because really, you know, there's kids watching and you're, you shouldn't be dropping the F-bomb, you know, and everything. And I get that. Um, yeah, I should pick it up because we've been just stayed in one spot. Um, yeah, I, I get that and everything. That It's like kids watching and it's probably better um, and everything without it and everything. But it's like the angry guys, you know, didn't make any sense for them not to be cussing. I mean, they're angry. I mean, everybody cusses when they're angry just about. Um, yeah, and so I get that. You know, but we, I miss the skits because of, you know, like I said... But they're fun to do and it's my kind of humor and stuff like that it's unfortunately not your guys kind of humor <laughs> well some of you mostly not i just wanted to show you what we've been doing back here and how um how flat it is now yeah so yeah it's pretty flat back here um, I'm going to take some trees down. I'm going to have to mark them which ones I'm going to take down. I'm going to start cutting them down very soon it cuts about one, two, three, four, maybe five, five trees, maybe six. I don't know for right now. But I want a nice big little field here. And then I got to get these stumps out, which would take a long time because Jeff was telling me, yeah, you might see me get clunked on the head by a, by a uh, acorn. They're falling right now. So, um, yeah. That's one of the things got going on. I guess, you know, I'll probably vlog cutting down trees because can't think of anything else to vlog anyway. But yeah, so I just want to encourage everybody out there. If you're like me or anybody else, you're going to go through times where it's really hard to think of uh, doing a video. Or you might get discouraged because the videos aren't doing, doing well. Um, yeah, I like our Oreo milkshake one. You know, it's like... Why would you not watch a video on doing the world's best Oreo milkshake? I mean, that thing was absolutely delicious. And I was I wanted to do another one, but I wanted to do a, uh, a Reese's peanut butter uh, milkshake. But, you know, after the last one, I don't know. Maybe, maybe I just got to space them out a lot further apart and everything. So, And the other thing is, if you guys could hit me up in the comments section, because I'm very curious about this. If you had a chance to watch our podcast and uh and you know participate like calling in or whatever because joe hasn't really clicked on people uh very much lately but if you had a chance to watch our podcast or listen to our podcast what night do you think would be best for you personally like to to, to tune in i'm trying to 
trying to figure out because we keep doing them on you know on Wednesdays mostly we tried a Monday that didn't work um, is it a Friday or a Saturday does does that work better um, I don't know I'm I'm curious to see but I need to see a, a kind of a large amount of people uh, comment to me what actual day would work best because if I just get like five, that could be just five people's best for them. But uh, I'm just curious, like what day of the week would you be more likely to tune into a podcast, a live stream with us? Very curious on that. If you guys could hit me up in the comment section, let me know. Hit me up on Twitter, let me know. Because uh, if it's Friday, if it's a Friday night or, or a different night or a Thursday night or whatever night, um, and you know, Joe's working at one of his other jobs. I, I'll just, you know, would you guys tune in if, if it was on a different night and it's just like me and Tom, or or uh, maybe me Kevin, on there without Joe. I mean, let me know in the comment section what you guys think would work, and uh, we can at least try it, see what happens. But anyway, I want to encourage you guys all. If you guys get into this place, this funk where you're like, yeah, that's probably sketchy that say that word like that. Um, Get into a place where you're you're feeling like defeated. Um, just keep on keeping on and work your way through it. I think you'll uh, you'll be happier in the long run that you kept doing it. I mean, I guess sometimes you gotta accept defeat, but uh, don't give in so quickly though. You know, I say you just keep on keeping on and just keep putting videos out there and just keep trying. You never know when something's gonna work your way and know that everybody goes through the spells of you know not being creative or getting depressed from doing it because of you know whether it, whether you're relying on the money or you're just relying on doing doing videos and having fun doing videos but yet you're maybe you're not having as much fun as you used to have or something like that just keep on everybody goes through little cycles like this so love you guys don't forget to uh tune into our podcast because you know that's that's a big part of uh, us and I really do and I've said this before I really do want to make a short a short little video for the for our members um, and and every week that I try to do this I I haven't had the time with the other stuff that we're doing to get one done but I really got to do one I wanted to do a little slappy guys uh, little skit for for just the members and everything you know i was thinking yep i put it out it's just for the members when when uh maybe for a week and then it gets to everybody else after a week but they're the first ones that get to watch it i gotta do that i gotta just stop thinking you know, you know talking about it and just do it that's the that's the phrase for today guys just do it love you guys Till next time grab yourself something cold to drink put your feet and relax I'll meet you at the lounge, somewhere around here.